Hello and welcome back to SMT3. You know where we're going, or maybe you don't, because you maybe didn't watch last episode or you have forgotten where we're going. So, where are we going? We are not going to the Hellbiker, despite the fact that it looks like I'm walking directly to the Hellbiker. This is just an optical illusion, because he's on top of the bridge and we're going to go down with the trolls below the bridge and uh, see what's going on there. Hopefully, somebody has, like, you know, uh, I kill the Hellbiker in one hit uh, potion or something. That would be useful. Some, something of that nature. It doesn't have to be exactly that, but that would be nice. I'm just checking who I have in my party. Yeah, this is kind of our best party. Hmm. I would like to get rid of Take, but I need to replace Take with something that can have uh, everything Take has but better. Which so far has not been uh, an option. So. We're going to ignore the bridge this time, despite my muscle memory taking me on it. We're going to walk over to this guy and see what he has to say. If you travel way over there, you'll reach the infamous Cabo Chico prison. Kind of a nasty place though. Wait a second. The biker isn't progress? That is new news to me. Okay. And this is the... Uh, Higashi Ikeburo Station. Hmm, okay. It's shut. Ah, okay, so this must be... Yeah, so this must be how you access the um, other side of the park. Because the park is a station entrance at the other side. Okay. Can't go into the temple. Ah, I see. So you can either take this... Oh, wait, no, that is the only route forward, because there isn't a way past this. Oh, all right. Well, you know, it's just Hellbiker. Good to know. Good to know. Um. Yeah, attack. Um. I'm trying to think what I want to do. I want to pass for Valkyrie. Yeah. That was pretty good. Feeling good about that one. Mabufuwa. Okay. Another attack. Uh, recruit. Are you asking me out? Then instead, how about like, uh, Babd uh, Badba Katha is thinking about this and that. Give me 500 maca. Okay. It's still too little. Give me 240 maca. Okay. Teehee, before I join, let me get your opinion. I've been thinking about something lately. From your point of view, what do you think of my skin? It looks hard. So you're saying it looks strong. Well, you're right. Cool. I, I have got one of the birds. That's fantastic. We have another thing we can potentially uh, fuse. Uh, let's head back. I mean, I have an Oni as well, right? Yeah, so we have actually a couple of things we can fuse. Uh, give me one more random fight before we get back. Uh, actually, we're definitely going to get one because I'm going to go in here. So that's fine. Um... So we should be able to grab one more thing as well. Oh, also, uh, just in case, very unlikely, but let's just heal up. Right. Uh, I'm also not going to take the fast way back of using the teleporter. I'm just going to walk back uh, just so we get that encounter guaranteed. Because I think we could, yeah, we could definitely have got to the teleporter without an encounter. So, this is good. This is good. Yeah, so let's return. I'm kind of half thinking get rid of Matador, but that that's stupid. I, I should get rid of... I don't know. Valkyrie, I guess, is also a... It, 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 it's on the shaky list of not really surviving. By the way, we didn't get an encounter. What's with our encounter rate right now? This is so low. That's incredibly low as <laughs> an encounter rate. Did we, like, maybe get past a certain level or something? I'm working this one out. Doesn't matter who I attack. Cool. Uh, I think I want to get the... I think I want to get the Necromaster. Because I think it's going to be a higher level and therefore will be better. So in a way, it really didn't matter what I did. As long as I killed the four. Hey, join me. Are you asking me out? I, I don't know. Give me Maka, okay. Give me Maka, okay. Um, another party member tried persuading her. I love this. 
Who are you? Shoo shoo. There was no effect. How can I live on that? Give me 270 maca. Okay. I trust you, but a little more. Give me a revival beat. Screw, yeah. screw that. <laughs> Absolutely under no circumstances will I give you a revival beat. Alright, pass. Join me. Yeah. Yeah, drain my energy. This is my favorite one, because it actually doesn't hurt us at all. Uh, yeah, I'll give you 200 maca. I still can't join you. One disc stun. Actually, not even that bad. <laughs> I mean, obviously, money-wise, not the best deal in the world, but, you know, it could have been a lot worse. Right, fusing. Welcome to the Cathedral oh. of Sha- yeah, yeah. Welcome to the Cathedral of Shadow. Are you sure? Blah -de -blah -de -blah. Hmm. Oh. Right. Register. Oh. Oh. oh uh, all right. Me. Let's have a look. So I'm 34. I can make a Yomosu uh, Shikome here. That's terrifying. Weakness to fire? Uh, no. We could make a Zuki. Uh, weakness to ice? I mean, that's pretty cool looking. It learns Recarm next level. Cool. I mean, it is out of our range right now, but we only need two levels for it. That's, that's a good one to remember. Okay, Oni. We already looked at, so there's none of these that I really want. I mean, I can upgrade Take, but it's still weak to fire. Will-O-Wisp just sucks. <laughs> yeah, still just sucks. I could make a... Ah, uh, I could fuse these to make a Momonofu, and then fuse the Momonofu into something else. Yeah, I think Lilum and Will-O-Wisp are, are you sure? just hot, hot garbage, so let's just are fuse, you sure? fuse these together. I don't care what ability I'm getting, because it's not going to be the thing that's providing the ability. Yeah, that's fine. All right. Let's fuse Momonofu. So we can make two uh, Pisakas here. Let's have a look. Weakness to fire, of course. I make Naga. I've already gone through this. Weakness to fire. I can make another Yomosu Tsukomi. Weakness to fire. Uh, or I can make a small pile of rocks. All right, so this is also All right. garbage. Oh. Yeah, I don't want to register that one. Okay, so I oh. just need to remember that All right. next time. Um, All right. Well, I need more demons then. So if I need more demons, it means I can't grind in the grind zone. So, hmm, or I try and get to level 34. <laughs> but this doesn't fix all of our issues. Yeah, I guess I, where do I grind now? Like, if I, if I want demons, where do I even... I guess I just run outside here until... I, I guess I have to go... Yeah, maybe go into the mantras place. That's the best place to find demons of a suitable level. Yeah. I, I don't have that much macro, though. I can't afford to get all these demons. Uh... uh Mazam. Okay. Pass. Yeah, um, Mazio. Okay. Uh, Mabuku. And attack. Nice. I got us a little bit of money, which at least means that we can, might be able to pay for something. Right, enter the Mantra's headquarters. Let's see what we can find in here. Um, I would guess the one that we're looking for is that kind of weird one of the mask that's weak to ice. I mean, I could have described half the enemies in there with that, but you know what I'm talking about. Yeah, not this one. This, this, this one I hate. Because they keep saying I'm going to join you and then don't join you. Uh, kill two, um, and then equip the last one. We use Mazeo, so it gives us the extra turn. All right, attack. Okay. Pass. Talk. Yeah, yeah, I'll give you the Maka. Lifestone, sure. Wow! <laughs> no, don't, you, don't, you didn't even take three things off me this time. You just completely blanked me. Okay. Well, 
travel down here. I guess we could look at the rooms. We haven't looked at all the rooms. I mean, we have, but like, we haven't looked at them since we've had the change, I guess. Like, what's in this room? Small one? Let's try and recruit one of the small ones. Uh, attack. Ice. Can't use AoE ice because then we'll kill the big guy. Oh, sorry, we'll kill the small guy. Uh, Zanma. Okay. Oh, they lose their turn. Nice. Perfect. Pass. 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 Talk. Doesn't look like it can understand. Okay. Pass. Talk. Doesn't look like it can understand. Is this just a permanent? It can't understand? I guess it didn't take my turn, so it wasn't a failure. Yeah, okay. Fair enough. I guess these ones can only join you if they kind of randomly walk up to you and join you. That you, you can't ask them to join you. Okay, someone's got nothing in it. Was there any... Yeah, there wasn't a hallway here. Oh, there was a hallway on the next one. Yeah, I suppose we could check that out as well. Who knows, there might be a secret there. At the very least, it's somewhere to walk. I haven't found any secrets in this game as far as I'm aware, so... Like, does it have any? I don't know. Maybe. Probably. Am I gonna find them? I don't know. That's the one I was looking for! Uh, we need to heal. ASAP. Uh, pass. Medea. Um... Bufula. Nice. Uh, heal. Kill. Talk. You want me to join you? What should I do? 450. Okay. 290. Ah, oh, yes, it's your time. Do it. A talker, eh? That worked. Well, I need your opinion on something before joining you. Let's say I do decide to help you. Will I get anything out of it? Of course you will. You lie! Oh, I forgot I was on an errand. See ya. Wow! <laughs> They're all so incredibly rude. Just like, I'm out. See you later. Um, we have enough money for one more attempt, I think. Yeah, so there's nothing here, because we said the pre-task left. We have the two doors over this way, I suppose. Was there anything else in here? Yeah, was that room up top? Hmm. I did check, actually I did check all of these doors, didn't I? Don't know why I'm going down the floor like it makes too much of a difference. It actually just means that we can't get an encounter right now. But I guess we can run outside of the uh, return point, which is probably better. Okay, and there we go. That's the fight we want. Mm. Okay, fine. Pass. Hit. Uh, we'll nice. You can't uh, do that because... Oh no, it's the wrong target! Okay. Oops. Hopefully it's like Pokemon, and when the weaker they are, the more likely they are to join you. Yeah, okay. We'll see. Right. Uh, talk. Yeah, yeah, talking's all you're good at. Give me 350 maca, okay. One life stone, okay. Why are youths these days so foolish? Would we be better off without them? Definitely. I guess I was a fool for even asking you. Oh, I forgot I was on an errand. Wow. They're always incredibly, like, rude. Okay, well. Um, yeah, so I don't really know what kind of answer that thing wants yet, but we know what answer is it doesn't want for two of them, which is nice. Would it be quicker to grind the money 
in the Labyrinth of Amala and just pay for something? Because we've already had all of these guys? Maybe. Maybe. Uh, okay. Hit him. Hit him. Zeo. Uh, hit him. Pass. And talk. Uh, 420 maca. Lifestone. Yes! It is your time, spinny arms. You can do it. Uh, plants have it easy. Have you ever wanted to live like that? No. Cool. I got a necromata. Wonderful. Well, I mean, I guess we're gonna return now, because I don't have any money, but... That does at least give us some options for, um, yeah, it gives us some options for fusing. We should hopefully get something we can fuse now. Just a strong thing that isn't weak to fire. That's all I'm asking, really. It's not a lot. It just has to not be weak to fire. And ideally not weak to force. And ideally strong against physical. But if it has all of them, then it's good. Fusing time. Welcome to the Cathedral of Shadows, where demons gather. So, we can make the same thing with the, uh, the Sweet to Fire. Okay. Black Ooze. I mean, it nullifies dark in the strong to physical. Is it better than Ari Habaki? Um... No. <laughs> That's okay. Uh, we can make things that are worse. We can make a unicorn, which is the same level. Which is weak to electricity. I mean, it nullifies light, curse, and mind. This one might not be too bad. Yeah. Yeah, look at this. Okay. Life refill. Does that just hit? Um, that probably heals you every turn or something like that, right? Yeah, so we could give it Rakunda. We do have Dikasha now as well, which I haven't used properly. Yeah, let's, let's pass this one along. Yeah, let's choose skills. Uh, so Dikaja is huge. Rakukaja must be the one that raises our defense. Kunda is good as well. Life bonus is okay. I think that I want Zionga mostly, although we are kind of fine without the electrical move. Life bonus is okay. I don't know, I'm kind of looking at this going, not that one, not that. It's basically between Mazio, Zionga, and um, Life Bonus. For this particular fight, I think Life Bonus is better. It has Mabufu as its as, as an AoE move. Yeah, <coughs> let's make this. Oh, and Kaget's uh, Suchi is at its brightest. That's where the music's all epic, okay. Oh, I can offer a sacrifice. Uh, Momonofu, because Momonofu is terrible. I mean, the other ones would give me a higher level unicorn, but I can't use the Valkyrie as a sacrifice, and I don't want to use that one, so I'm going to use Momonofu. Yeah. Okay. Are you sure? No, because I just noticed I got an extra ability. Focus actually is by far the best ability you could ever offer, but what? Let's have a look. What else I got? I got Lunge. Nah, no, okay. Focus, Dekaja... Rakunda, life bonus. Cool. I want to make this. Are you sure? Uh, no, it reset the things. Okay. <laughs> life bonus, Rakunda, Dikaja. Interestingly, I don't need to take one from the second thing. I can, I can just take Zionga. You know what? Let's take. Oh, but focus is really good though. But your strength is really low, and you don't have lunge. Yeah. Okay. Let's go with this. Confirm. Are you sure? Yes, I'm sure. Do we get a special cutscene? I mean, I'm willing to wait. Because you do see the two... Yeah, okay, so you get a slightly different cutscene. Oh, yeah. Look at that. That's doing work. They just get deleted. It also said it could change into a different demon, didn't it? Hmm, 
wonder if it will. Oh, it has. No, it hasn't. It's unicorn. When when it went all when it had like the dark skin, I was like, oh, it's a different thing. I'm unicorn of the holy clan. Charmed, I'm sure. All right. Oh. Let me just see what I, I've got. Yeah, yeah, I can register. Are all you sure? Now. Hmm. Oh. All right. Okay. Can I make the unicorn into anything? I can make it into a co, into a kumo kuten. We tell electricity repels force. Uh huh. Uh huh. Hmm. Stat wise, I mean, it's not blowing up the world, but it's got good HP. Hmm. Okay. I can also make a G E a G a G high a G high. It's weak to elements. Okay. Hmm. Interesting. I can also make a Yomotsu. Yeah, yeah. Do I want to make this one? That's the question. So what would that leave me in my party? That would leave me. Um. It would leave me the Kumo Kuten. It'd leave me the Matador and the Ari Habaki. Now, this would give me a repel on force, which is quite nice. It is weak to electricity, which is lovable. What could I give it? Let's say I wanted to give it the perfect stuff. What would I give it? The heal is really nice occasionally. The ice is also... The problem is, it's kind of like our... It's got so many abilities. <sighs> no, it's got too many abilities on it for me to fuse into that one. Unicorn into one of these, though, would be okay. Does it make it better? If I was to give this one... What's Liftoma? Don't need it. Um, if I give it... If I gave it... And I can get one more as well. So, ah, but I can only... I can't get, like, Medea in here. Yeah, I think Unicorn might be our best bet. Yeah, All okay, right. let's leave. So what is Unicorn's stuff now that I have it? <laughs> unicorn. Okay. Hmm, is it good enough? That's the question. I don't know, it's fine. It is better than Take was because it's not weak to fire. I think that's his main benefit. Um, it, yeah, is that it? I guess that's it for my plan. Yeah, it's not a great plan, really. I might go and level up. Um, I was thinking <laughs> I want to level up Ari Habaki, like just a tiny bit, and that will also let us get some more money. So let's go to Labyrinth of Amala and do that. The reason I want to do it is it's 900 off. Uh, does doing it get me a new ability or just, it gives me Stone Gaze, which isn't too useful. But it will get me another stat, which is quite nice. So, yeah, so why don't I, in this party, what's Master getting next to Kunda? Soul Recruit. Um, I don't know. Um, I'm trying to think what, I want to maybe also level Unicorn? No, I can't level Unicorn, it's too far out. You know what, I'm just going to go do the fight. Let's just save and then do the fight. I want to try it again. Um, the question is, do I take the unicorn in first to remove any stat effects? It doesn't actually go for stat ups too often. It mostly just removes the negatives that we apply to it. Yeah, so maybe, yeah, okay, I got what I'm doing with my party. I thought, I've thought, I've thought it through. So Valkyrie is immune to fire, so I want it as late in the fight as possible. So, what I want to do is have unicorn out earlier than Valkyrie. Right? Um, what's the agility? Agility is seven. Okay, so party, return to stop. These two. Summon out Unicorn and Aribaki. Cool. Let's do that. That's 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 my plan. So if I do this, then I can hold Valkyrie for later in the fight. And if I can hold it until the second phase, like if Unicorn dies just before the second phase, that's kind of good for us, I think. That's my, that's my current plan. We're fully uh, healed up. Yeah, let's go. I might even do the full run. 
and just not care about uh, the fact that we can maybe get a quicker from somewhere in between. Unless we get, like, crit here. Which isn't impossible. Um, Xana? Pass. Uh, Mabuku? Not really that strong as an attacker. Um, Mabuku? Nice. Uh, Mazaz. Oh! You're still alive. We killed the one that focused, which is nice, and then it focused. Okay. Nice crit. Cool. Um... Do I have a heal? No, I don't have a heal on my... I have that heal. I was trying to think if I had a better heal on my back. I said don't. Uh, let's use medicine. Medicine kind of sucks now. So we'll use that. Just for a snare. Oh, another fight. Guess it's decided to fix my encounter rate. Nice, okay. It lost the turn and got it back, so we're kind of neutral on that one. Uh, attack. Wonderful crit. Um, attack. We don't. Oh, no, we do have electricity. I was thinking we didn't have Valkyrie, so we didn't have electricity, which was going to be a problem, but that's okay. Um, that should be fine. Nice. Cool. Got it. We actually should save at the save point because we've got 200 XP for um, Ari Habaki. Yeah. Okay. Cool. I'm a little disjointed this episode. I'll admit, I'm not entirely sure what the best path is, and that never leads to uh, decisive decision making. Why is our encounter rate so high compared to what it was? I'm oh, it's because I have you. It must be based on your um, party's level, and I have Unicorn in it, there, right? Maybe that's it. Maybe my average party level is now lower, so I'm getting a higher encounter rate. That's my new theory. I think that makes a lot of sense. So I'm gonna just believe it's true. Oh, it double hit us, which is kind of annoying. If it hit everyone, it wouldn't have mattered because I'm gonna use a heal anyway. Like an AoE heal. But I think I now need to use a single heal. Hey, I got lifestone. Cool. Uh, there we go. See, I was just going to do one of those, but because it hit me twice, I'm now too low to actually heal off of one of those. There we go. Something like that looks good. We might, do a, uh, we might put us back up to full health right before I do the Hellbiker fight. I just don't want to, like, overheal too much because we're um, likely going to get one encounter. So there's a chance we get back hit. Right. You know Unicorn's dying turn one, right? I mean, Valkyrie always died turn one, so, like, it's a guarantee that Unicorn is dying turn one. I just thought I'd let you know, you know? Despite there being no reason for Valkyrie to die every single time on turn one, it always did, so. Right, round here. Uh, we are actually going to make it without a fight. Cool. Um... Let's use our last lifestone. Yeah, we're, we're good to go. Yes, I will stay here. Are you sure? Oh, of course. Definitely. Get ready for the voice acting. Uh, oh, and the loud motorcycle. to go. Suck on some fumes! Goodbye, unicorn. Oh, wait, never mind. It's fine, because it used uh, that first. Okay. Uh, what are we going to do now? Uh, uh, let 
Let's see. I think pass on our first turn, although we could raise our attack. Alright, let's work this out. If I raise our attack, what are we doing? Raise attack, heal. No, raise attack, war cry. Pass, heal, raise attack? Yeah, maybe that's what I do. I have to use war cry though. Um, yeah. That's fine. We could heal here, but I think passing is a more sensible move. Yeah. Then, uh, heal. Just because that heal is going to be higher. Then buff attack. That actually removes our buff attack, which is annoying, but hey, what can you do? Um, buff attack again? Alright, let's think about what I'm doing. If I buff attack... Okay, I got it. Buff attack. Um, we could heal, I suppose. Uh, I'm only gonna have enough MP for one more uh, war cry anyway. So let, yeah, let's heal. Lower... Oh, I could raise our defense, but that's not really gonna do too much against this. Let's lower their defense. And focus. I think that's a good turn. Okay, double block is fine. Okay. Raise attack. Maybe it uses Hell Exhaust if you raise your um, stats. Maybe that's the trigger. Hmm, that would be good. Yeah, um... I could raise our defense, I suppose. I mean, that would work, in theory. Uh, because we're only going to be hit by one move. Let's raise defense and then lunge. Yeah, lunge. Oh, come on. That's horrible. Okay, well... Raise attack. <laughs> um, we can do one more heal instead of a war cry. That's fine. Heal. I guess I got focus. Unfortunately. Yeah, it is worth doing it. That's fine. That, that's fine. Okay. So, what I want to do... I can actually raise our attack again, which gives us a third level attack raise. Nice. Um, War Cry. So we need MP as our next thing. Raise defense doesn't matter too much. Lower defense, though, is a good turn to use. It. So that's third level lowering, I think, as well. Then lunch. 510. Not amazing, but I'll take it. Alright. Fine. Uh, I'm gonna use the one that um, that gives us full MP at the, on this turn. Which is why I'm kind of going MP light. Uh, what's it called? Bam of life. There we go. Cool. Feeling better. You can now spend another turn lowering their defense. It's gonna, it's gonna Dakunda after this turn, but that's okay. Focus. If it uses Dakunda, that's fine. Doesn't bother me at all. Didn't use Dakunda. Wonderful. Also great, great to see. Raise our attack. Uh, you got anything you want to apply right now? No, I think I'm actually good just attacking. 200 damage is a base move there. Oh, ho, ho, ho. lunge? 689, phase 2. Not in phase 2. You did kill Unicorn, but that's actually perfect, because you killed Unicorn before phase 2. Raise physical attack, summon, heal. Yeah, okay. Raise physical attack, summon Valkyrie, which means that we've now effectively brought in Valkyrie as like just a fresh new unit. 
pass. Heal. So we're good to go now. Perfect. Actually perfect move. Tower Kaja. I think we're just going to attack this turn. Yeah, just attack. 300 damage? Ho oh, ho. I could use Guillotine. It seems like a good turn to use it. 347 and attack. That's a lot of damage. You're the first one to ever keep up with me. But can you keep up with this? Probably not. As I said every time. Health Rottle. This is our best attempt so far. This is incredible. We blocked that. Yeah, 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 yeah. We blocked that. Well, sort of. But that still works. Okay. Raise it. Raise attack, it didn't remove its defense downs, and it's got that kind of I'm looking weak look, so. Raise attack, 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 heal. Yeah, okay. Raise attack. Attack. Guillotine, don't miss. You killed it! With a crit! Oh, look at that! That was not too bad. Okay. First attempt on this episode. Strength increased. We've got Stone Gaze. Uh, which is obviously being chucked in the garbage. Where it, does, uh, where it belongs. Mudo, huh? Mudo is actually useful. Mudo, um, if you know that they're weak to a dark type move, I believe is 100% effective. At least it is in the Persona game, so that seems useful. And it seems to be the case in this one. So it could be a useful thing if we're going to run into more of that. Persuade has actually turned out to be a lot more useful than I thought it would be. Right now, there's nothing I really want to get rid of on this thing. Maybe Mazan? It's kind of fallen off a little bit, but I don't know. Yeah, I'll take your gift. It's a, a Megido Rock, which I think is almighty damage? Although we haven't seen any of that. Menorah of Dignity. Nice. Cool. So we can walk back now. All I need to do is survive the walk, which shouldn't be too bad. We did have to use a bomb of uh, life there, which is maybe overkill. Well, it wasn't overkill because it let us kill it, but what I'm meaning is it's a very valuable item. Um, at least right now. Um, just checking. Is this Magitama? No, it's not shaking, so I should swap my Magitama. Yes, I should swap my Magitama now. Uh, to this one? To the one that imparts dark magic? Because the one that we've got for physical isn't, uh, isn't shaking right now? It is. Okay, it is shaking. Oh yeah, we should twitch to this one. Yeah. If it's shaking, which it is. Cool. Right. Uh, where are we going now? So back to where we were. Okay. Yeah. Sorry, I was just a little confused. I was like, is there anything else I need to do this second? No, I think we're fine. I mean, I could rearrange my party order, but that doesn't really matter. Uh, do we use the teleport back? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. We, we don't want to die. And we want to avoid all chances of randomly dying, so teleport back is the best way. In fact, yeah, it's even better than that, because it's also a save. But yeah, let's go back. So, save. We have now officially beaten Ghost Rider. Hellbiker, I think it's called. Uh, and then we can exit. Cool. Uh, let's heal. Oh, we might get the next bit of lore as well. For, oh no, we won't get the next bit of lore from Lady because we need to finish the area for that. But we'll, get, uh, we'll at least get to the next um, menorah zone in here. So... Let's go to the Labyrinth of Amala, which is quite definitely our next stop. Um, I should change my party around as well. I think actually we probably could have done it with Take as well, with that previous lineup that we had there. Uh, all I needed to do was swap in Valkyrie at the end rather than having Valkyrie at the start. I think that was actually the only change I needed to make. But, anyway, that's fine. Because I think I swapped in Take previously and it doesn't make sense with the weaknesses, but it's fine. 
Uh, I also don't think we really need to use Unicorn anymore. It has useful abilities, but I don't think it's um, like high priority to use. Yeah, let's jump in. Hey, and this will get us some money as well. Wait, we have uh, above 20... Um, we have above 20 strength, so I'm going to try and break one of the brown ones. I didn't really get us anything. Okay. Uh, I wonder what the brown ones get you. Because we've had all of the... Um, all of the macro before, but we... Um, yeah. We've had all the macro before, but we didn't hit any brown ones, so... I don't know. Let's do a little heal after that. By a little heal, I mean quite a lot of a heal, because I got absolutely destroyed, but that's okay. I was also thinking of our party, the ideal thing is to keep this one at the bottom and Valkyrie long enough that they level up again, like they evolve again. Because they have amazing abilities on them, that it's just the characters themselves aren't quite that good right now. Although Valkyrie is good, it, it just, it's unlucky. I don't know if unlucky really uh, is something you can blame it for. Uh, it's more just random chance that I've attributed to uh, the thing being bad. Right. Our encounter rate is definitely lower with this party. Look at it. We made it all the way to this door without a single encounter. Yeah, so it must be based upon the party that you have out determines your encounter rate. So if you want a higher encounter rate in a lower leveled area, you bring along a low leveled uh, thing. That makes sense. Okay, we could try that. Yeah, jump in, obviously. That's why I'm here. Okay, uh, we're starting with a little turning. Oh, I hit one. This is just terrible. Uh, hit it. Uh, missed the I think the brown ones are just blockers. I think that's their entire purpose in life, is just to be kind of annoying. I attained 494 Maka and a Discharm. But I also took so much I almost died! Okay. Uh, I got you the other Menorah! Yeah! Interestingly, it was the Menorah of Dignity, and I don't think the biker had any. Menorah has been lit. The menorahs have been lit even. Uh, why did it get darker in there when the door opened? <laughs> now, does this unlock the shortcut back to the start? That's the next question. It does! Okay, so that unlocks the shortcut back to the start. Wonderful. This is a new area. Okay. Uh, I'm going to take the shortcut back to the start. Yeah. So now we never need to go in the first area unless we want to. Which is good to know. Uh, let's get some of this healing. Okay. Hey, item. That's fine. Didn't get hit, which is what really matters. Okay, got all of them, and hey, the last one had some maca in it. Nice. 550 maca and a dis poison. That's, yeah, that's almost worth farming. <laughs> it's like 500 maca a time. Yeah, I, I could get used to that kind of life. Uh, do we want to go heal? No, I should be alright. I should have been using the unicorn's heal anyway. Uh, right, let's save, and then, uh... We can head back down again. Cool. I just didn't want to go through the whole process of walking down and lighting the menorah again, so which is why I thought I'd go up and save. Also got us 500 maca, which is eh, not, nothing to be sniffed at. Uh, in fact, it's going to get us 1,000 maca in total because we have to go back down again. So, yeah. So, jump. I think it only makes you do the second half, which is also interesting here. That only makes you do a second half one. 
which all actually appears to be pretty much identical. Although there's probably, yeah, actually this one isn't identical. They probably have, it's, it's similar, but they probably have, like, patterns. Uh, like the first one had. So you have one of several patterns. Ow. Hey, lots of money. Last one I think always has Maka in it. Maybe the patterns have the exact same Maka and the exact same uh, things. It's to encourage you to learn it, maybe. Hmm. Maybe. Right, in we go. So, what are we facing down here? Uh, that's interesting. But also, uh, whatever we're facing down here, we cannot recruit, which is it is something worth knowing. Oh, this is a one-way... Hello. I just heard a voice coming from your direction. It was like the voice of the universe. You weren't harmed, were you? Ah, yes, you, you heard uh, one of the angels, maybe. Well, yep. So this one does not give you the quick way out. You can still farm in the, in the entrance, but it doesn't give you a quick way out. A lot of souls have been gathering in the labyrinth. Everyone around here keeps arguing about Gaia, Gaia and Messiah, whatever those are. Well, if you walk around, you'll see. I think those were the names of personas, so probably the names of demons. There's a way up. Obviously, we yeah, we obviously can't get back up the way that we, um, that we came down because, um. It's working it. Yeah, because there was no way to climb up that hole. The door is locked. Okay. Um, I thought the silver one previously was the one that showed the people who killed. These are black oozes, I think. Uh, let's try Mazan. All wheat to Mazan. Cool. Uh, how about... Oh, Okay, so that's Foul Blob, Foul Black Goose. Punching is fine. Mazeal. That's the weakness of the oozes. Okay. Uh, I guess I'll just attack these ones then. Electricity. I don't know what the weaknesses of the blobs are yet, but that's okay. These don't seem too bad. If that's the enemy of this area, I'm happy with that. We, we can cope. Um... You know, that's uh, famous last words. What have we got in here? Ooh, okay. Hello. The soul is too busy talking to notice you. Everyone, listen. The world has lost its power under the reign of God. Because of that, we are on the verge of destruction. But there is no need to fear. The ring of Gaia will ensure our victory. Together, we will resurrect the strength of the ancient world. Oh, right. The Ring of Gaia was the thing that I wish I could remember his name. The guy with the fedora told us about all the way back at the park. Yeah, okay. And it's the thing that we got the magazine about. Interesting. Hmm. Nothing in here. This way? Just follow a path and keep to it. It's basically the best way to go around. That looks like another way down. Is that a Will-O-Wisp? Oh, no. It's, it's, it's like an upgraded Will-O-Wisp. Mazan? Hey, it's the weaknesses of the two in the middle, which are phantoms. Okay. How about you? All right, not very strong. Mazio? Cool. Um, Mazan? We already know it's Mazan. Oh, you dodge. Zeodyne is heavy down. Last Resort is like the most annoying thing you could imagine. Okay, Phantoms uh, need to be dealt with ASAP because they have Last Resort. We leveled up. Uh, another point in strength. Are we going to keep this one? Probably not because we're probably going to die. Focus is better than... Um... Hmm. I want to take focus. I don't want to take get rid of life bonus right now. Because I feel like I need HP. Analyze is not useful against bosses. 
I think I have to get rid of Analyze. That's not a thing that I thought I would say, but it's what I did. Yeah, sure, I need a party heal. Oh, thanks for the free magic increase? Okay, sure. Uh, luckily in our party, we do have Unicorn, which we can summon. Uh, and we can probably do some heals with, uh, oh, yeah, a couple heals there, and then, like, a heal there. Cool. Hello. We were just looking for a way to live in peace with nature and the ancient gods, but the Messiah Church, brainwashed by a jealous god, won't allow us to do so. I'm telling you, they're the ones who should be oppressed, not us. Okay. I'm being uh, recruited into a cult. Good to know. Well, that links back round to a room we've already been in. Maybe? No, we haven't been in this. Is this where we dropped? No. No, we haven't been in this room. Yeah, okay. It just revealed the whole room when we got in here. Hit Raja Rock. Oh, right. The thing I was going to check ages ago. Um, it is Almighty Damage. Okay, so it's still called Almighty Damage. I just that rock uh, it's not Mazan for these ones, so it's just attacking. Oh, they just die in a hit, huh? Nice crit. Cool. That's my type of fight. Also, yeah, I am gonna do that. Uh, boom. And perfect. Right, um... That's another way down. <laughs> I don't know if I want to go further down. This might be a one-way place. Why? It's definitely a one-way place, huh? Okay. Tornado. They're all weak to force. I love it. I need to just kill them. So, Mazio? Um, uh, attack. Wrong choice. We're dead. Okay, so that Labyrinth of Amala one is a dead end, effectively. Like, we can farm there, but if we're going in, we're going in. That's good to know. It's good to know. Um, I'm trying to think what we want to do with that then. We probably want to just ignore it entirely until we reach a point in the game that we cannot progress through. The enemies didn't seem that difficult. It just seemed like it was somewhere we didn't want to go. Like, right now. Okay, cool. Well, I think I'm going to end the episode there, and next time we're going to carry on towards the main story. Yeah, because we know that when we, we will know the point where we've gone way too far to come back here is when there are fiends that we need to kill, because that will imply that we're unlocking the next floor. So that all makes sense. So, I'm going to end the episode here. Thank you for watching. I'll see you next time. Goodbye.